Hold on. I was like walking a little bit just now. Okay, I'm fine. Okay. So, hello, everyone. Wait for somebody to. Okay, there's one person that's probably like my mom or dad, but hello. It's me, Ayla. I don't know why my lips always look ashy. Anyways, it's me, Ayla, once again, here from the Unapologetic Nomads, as you can tell. That's the channel name. But, um,. <laughs> I'm here today at, I'm about to drop something, oh my gosh. I'm here today at, can you see that? Kezamia, that's in French, but restaurant, yeah. And so today we're here, you know, with me and my parents, we're here today to try, you know, food. It's a restaurant, so yeah. And as you can see here, this is gonna be surprising. All right, there's lighting, whatever, that's fine. Hello everyone joining, hello. We got 10 people in the room. Hello, how are y'all today? How are y'all today? But here, oh wow, yeah. Wow, this is amazing. As you can see here, look what we have. Ducks. I think that's like the mother duck or something. The um, other little ducklets. That's probably not the correct name from any of those, but yeah, as you can see. I don't know what that is back there. I think that's a turkey, but there's some turkeys actually in here as you can see so yeah some turkeys in there back there i think those are more ducks so yeah so here's the place i just walked in from there so okay here's the sign on the side of the building or the name and here's the restaurant this is coming in from the front i believe yeah but hello everyone coach remy hello everyone happy wednesday hello coach remy and look what we have here oh lord that scared me the car came in like driving really fast okay we have bunnies in here bunny rabbits i think because those are like big so yeah bunny rabbits as you can see they're grubbing grubbing wait it's not focused can it really why would you focus on the fence thank you the bunny rabbits that's a big one right here. If I got that, I would name it like Stuart. Because like, why not? <laughs> so, it's pretty plush though. And over here, y'all screaming. I think these are like geese. Over here. So yeah. Wait, let me see if I can get... I, I don't want to get too close because they look... Yeah. But yeah, geese. So now I'm gonna go inside. Y'all good? My oh, gosh. Okay, and then here, I'm gonna walk inside. Here's the front. There's a little store, some cheese, and stuff like that. <clears throat> yeah, some more stuff, drinks and all that. The fridge with the drinks some products and stuff you can buy i believe this is like a store bags i believe a lamp nice hair things i think those are for your hair other products mm -hmm. some earrings stuff like that baskets purses so yeah Nice stuff like that. Wait, let me read the comments. It's a little dark. What did I say, Boo Boo Gang? Hey, Ayla, hey, Ayla, where's the fam? They're in there and we're gonna see them in a minute, actually. It's the front. Hello. What's this? Hello. Hello. <laughs> All right, and here's a nice seating area right there. It's pretty plush out here. Okay, let's go over here. Here's a little path and everything. Got a nice little playground area for the kids. 
Oh, there's more seating back there. I didn't even see that. Oh. Yeah. Some tire swings. Those. It's a big tree. Yeah. A little area over here. Oh, it's more seating. Speakers. And let me talk loud because I don't know if y'all can hear me. I don't got the mic in right now. But, yeah. TV. Oh, there's a TV in there and everything. More seating area. Uh, let's go in there. <clears throat> yeah. A nice little area. Mm hmm All right. Seating over there, too. They're kind of doing construction on the other side of that wall, so it's, like, loud. But, yeah. And look at this. We have a Bambi. Hello. And it's pretty friendly because I think the owner said uh, she's been here since a baby. See, she's real friendly. Sniffing. <laughs> she got long eyelashes, too. <laughs> but I think this is a mango tree. Not you slapping me in the face. You know what? That's disrespectful. Anyways. But yeah. More seating. Serene and spacious. Yeah, it's, pretty, it's nice and serene out here. Yeah. And look. Who we have stumbled upon. Look who we happen to have here. Ah. The one and only. Parents. Hey, <laughs> What's up, family? Y'all know who it is. The unapologetic. No mask. And we unapologetic. Nomadic. <laughs> Nomadic. Yeah. Who my arm? Hold on. All right. I know your arm don't hurt just from that. That don't make no sense, Ava. Yeah, my arm strength is at a strong one. We need to do some uh, working out here. I know. I need to do what some push ups or something. Yeah. Glad to use the microphone. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Quality everything. What's up, everybody? Though y'all know who it is, man. Y'all know who the face is. Y'all know who the family is, man. Don't act like y'all don't know. A lot of faces out there need to get fixed, family. You know what I'm saying? But this one right here, don't. This one right here is perfect. I'm about to show y'all. I'm about to do it. I'm about to do it, family. That one right there is perfect, right there, family. Aww. That's right. And all this <laughs> lovely perfection. Yeah. The beautiful, hue beautiful wife. Yes. Oh, he's gonna make me cry. Right, oh, come on. <laughs> <laughs> um, peace, love, and this light to all of you out there. Um, thank you for tuning oh, in yes. again. And uh, definitely, yeah, happy Wednesday to everybody out there. I hope everything is going just lovely for you guys. Um, wherever you are in the world, and um, you're at peace, you're happy, you're doing something that you enjoy doing. It's good to see y'all every day. It's good to see you guys. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, family. Let me fix this right here for a second. One second. Oh, yeah, there's a stand on. Uh, one second. This dude got a stand on. Yeah. Can yeah, you just. Um, can you turn it on now? Can yeah. I turn it away? Like the camera the itself. Can you move oh, that phone? open? Mm -hmm. uh, Thank you, like stand Please clean the camera lens. Yeah, we, I'm yeah, about to clean it now because uh, it'll be having. That oh, that's the wrong way. <laughs> yeah, okay. It's a little fuzzy. All right. I think it one second, it family. Yeah, open from the bottom. A little fuzzy, okay. Do y'all got any napkins or paper or something? I do. You do? Mm -hmm. hey, good morning, family, from cold Southern Maryland. You're always eating well. Yeah, you know what? We, um, yeah, can you hear us? Because, um, it might be a tad bit fuzzy. Oh, man, we got Big Dev in the building. What's up, family? How's the family doing? Yeah, I hope that's better. Let us know if uh, if that's better for you, family. But yeah, we out here. We in a beautiful restaurant right now called Kazamia in Bujumbura, Burundi. And we're uh, waiting on the food and everything. Hey, man, we're good. Good, man. Um, man, I wanted to holler at y'all about an idea I had, man. Because y'all, uh, you know, y'all really doing... Uh, Big things, man. Y'all real smart and um, intelligent, brothers and sisters. And um, Big Dev, I got to holler at you, man. Because, um, yeah, I don't want to say too much on here. Yes, it's really fast. It sounds like a language from the continent. All right. I'm confused on that one, family. I'm, I probably missed some things. 
But yeah, peace and love to the family. We're the Unapologetic Nomads. My name is Aaron. I'm Ayla. Yeah. And I'm Michelle, a.k.a. Mickey. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. And we come to you today um, in Bujumbura, and we travel the world. And right now, we're in Burundi, and we go to different <laughs> restaurants and things like that of that nature. And we, <laughs> right now, we're just eat, about to eat food, I think, and, and stuff. Yeah. Yeah, because today, we order, and we finna be eating and whatnot <laughs> wow. Wow. at this restaurant. Yeah, anything. Yeah. So like hi and I think <laughs> <laughs> Hi everyone. What what does that say? Oh, say it really fast. It sounds like an Oh, it's a comment. They're um so we're spelling something out or saying something and say if you say it fast it sounds like Oh the food is here. Wow. Yeah, whatever. Okay, so right now we got the food. Yeah. Oh, man, let me turn this. Look at that. Oh, man, that looks delicious. Thank y'all. Yeah, those are some nice shirts, too. Cool. Thank you. Yeah. All right, so what I have is what I probably always get, the fish um, brochette. I got chips. Um, Ayla has the same thing because she likes to copy. <laughs> That's right. Uh huh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And what do you have, lovely wife? I have the fish brochettes with the curry sauce, but I also I have mashed potatoes. I'm gonna try their oh. mashed potatoes today. Uh -huh. Yeah. Switched it up a little bit on us. Yeah. Are uh, the chips the same as French fries? Yeah, yeah, they are. You know what? We've been in Africa so long. We've been calling them chips and not French fries. But yeah, it's the same exact thing. And shout out the high vibe. Salute to you, family. Shout out to all, all the members. We love y'all. We appreciate y'all. Yes, we do. Good morning from New Jersey. High vibe. Yeah, shout out to Jersey. What part of Jersey are you from, high vibe? Yeah. Let us know. Did y'all meet Bambi yet? Bambi is out here somewhere. Oh, okay. Y'all met Bambi. Okay, cool. All right. Yeah. All right, so what I'm going to do, family, I'm going to try to uh, set the camera up so that we can eat and things from jersey yeah bloomfield jersey shout out to bloomfield jersey yeah peace and love to jersey peace and love to philly peace and love to um peace and love to delaware hey yeah shout out to westchester pennsylvania and uh bristol pa you know what i mean shout out to um uh, newcastle delaware and, and, and places like that in chester yeah yeah, so we about to uh, get down, but we going to let y'all know how everything is tasting and everything, because, uh, you know, that's how we do it. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. And the camera is on the lovely wife, and she's about to let us know what the whole entire deal is. Yeah. So, I'm a foodie. I love food. So <laughs> the, okay, this is the, the fish brochette, right? And I have a curry sauce with mine. I don't know if you can see that. Nice and bright yellow, and then I have the mashed potatoes. I'm gonna dip them, dip it in here. Curry sauce. Oh my god! Stop playing. Whoa! That curry sauce is amazing. That was good. That's good. Mm. So can you please tell us? Just giving them them India vibes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so it takes you to like uh, that's the curry. I was about to say Bangladesh, but that's a different country. <laughs> it this takes you to like um, Mumbai. It might be Mumbai or Hyderabad. I have a friend from Hyderabad. Oh. There might be some Hyderabad going on right there. <laughs> the mash ain't bad. It's it's very um, it's um. They have the butter in there, okay. and it's seasoned very well. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's buttery. Mm. I'm good. They're real buttery. Got a right amount of salt. It's creamy. Now I got to ask you: Is it like is it like grandmama's mash? Grandmama's is whipped a little bit more, a little bit more, um, to make it like smooth, smooth, smooth. But okay. these are well seasoned. I'm gonna be honest; they're well seasoned. Okay. Very good. All right. So how about? Yeah, yeah, I taste it. Hold on. Let me spit my gum out. I'm right. Hold on. 
So, High Vibe has a great question. High Vibe, who is a member mm-hmm. and a wonderful person from Bloomfield, New Jersey, mm-hmm. asks, what is the price of the meal? Mm-hmm. All right. So, yeah. we haven't tallied that yet. But we'll get to that soon. Oh, at the end. At the end, yeah. Okay. we got to tally everything. So we have right. the fresh juice and everything. So I have the fresh watermelon juice. Ah. All right. And they add a little ice to it. And I think you guys have different... But, um, yeah, I got the uh, Manacucha. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Taste the mash. Right, hold on, hold this, Ayla. Yeah. Taste the mash. Mm-hmm. Seasoning is good. Salt and butter. That's good. Mm-hmm. It's nice and soft. The texture is perfect for mashed potatoes. Okay, you like that texture. Um, okay. I feel like you're extremely close, but it's cool. <laughs> no, no. It's not. All right. Um... The salt and butter, the butter is the hero because it's real extreme buttery. Mm. It tastes like Sunday morning almost. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> nice. It tastes like Sunday morning. It's almost like grits, but it's not. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. See? They're good. That's good. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And everything is natural. It's fresh. Oh, yeah. I got to taste mm-hmm. my food too. Yeah. So we kind of like had the same thing the um, curry oh. fish brochette. So I'm gonna eat it now. Oh. Hmm. The onion's good. Mm-hmm. Okay. It's good. It's like India. Mm. That has different spices and seasonings on it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I taste yeah. a little. I taste a little extra spice in that um, in that uh, mashed potatoes. It's like a. Not spice, but it's like a seasoning in there that's that's unknown, but it's it's it's, it's really good. Yeah. Fries are good. It's good. Oh yeah. Mhm. Okay. So someone asked an interesting question. Um, what unique food do Burundians eat? Um, I believe mukeke is one, which is the fish that uh, only grows in uh, Lake Tanganyika. I believe. Um, like elk, the Capitan fish, which is, we, we've been eating this fish every day. Um, I've never ate fish this much. I feel like I need to go in the sea and just start swimming or something, family. <laughs> um, what else we got? Uh, Ugali, I, I believe. Um, something else unique that I've had here because I wish we had a, a Burundian brother or sister here to explain some more dishes, but those are the dishes I know, family. Um, I'm trying to think of something else, but I, it's not coming to the top of my head. But definitely a lot of fish dishes, lot of fish dishes because it's so close to Lake Tanganyika. Hold on. Mm-hmm. I had one fish dish, and it was the sang. Ooh, what's the name Sangala. of that fish? Sangala. It's a fish called Sangala, and they make a mushroom sauce. It goes over it. That thing is amazing. I'm like, wow. That That was a really... Really good dish, mm. yeah. They have different types of fish here, a lot of different fish dishes, but that one was like that was amazing. Nice. It's a creamy mushroom sauce just over the fish, and the fish I think was grilled. It was very good, it's very, very tasty. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so Stephen AM says, Y'all are inspiring to grow my online classes so I could get out of here and travel. Hey, uh, Steph- mm-hmm. Stephanie, I'm sorry, I said Stephen. Um, definitely, um, do what you have to do. You know what I'm saying? Um, do what you have to do to get that bag or to find a way where you could do what you want to do. You know what I mean? Yeah, there's nothing stopping you but yourself, family. Yeah, nothing stopping you but yourself. Yeah. Um, it's very important to open up your mind to new situations and new opportunities. Yeah. Facts. Um, good morning from Houston, Texas. Shout out to Houston, Texas. My cousin um, Cheryl Jackson lives in uh, Houston, Texas. I believe it's Houston. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, in Houston. Shout out to her and shout out to the family. Yeah. Mm. Un, unexposed experiences. I've been trying to visit a friend in the Gambia headed to Kenya in December. Our forever home is there and we visit twice a year now. Cool. Nice. That's cool, man. Shout out to the Gambia and everybody that's out there. Shout out to Uzman Ture, who is from the Gambia. Very cool brother. Very cool brother. 
Um, Rube M, Yo Hillary, time you stop yo yoing us natives. Time for some decent Swahili. Fit y'all three in one shot and say together, Twaji Vinjari na Twashukururu Mwalana. I probably butchered that family. <laughs> Butcher it all you care. Yeah, I, I, I definitely know I did, family. But shout out to all the brothers and sisters who speak Swahili. I'm still in class trying to learn. So if there's any, like, phrases that I need to know, please let us know now on this live so that we can uh, work on that family, yeah. Shout out to PT. Salute to you, family. Shout out to you. Hey, family, is the food more seasoned there in Burundi than TZ or Kenya? No hate, but some East African countries don't use as much seasoning. I'm going to have to say a quick yes. The food here is extremely seasoned very well. Um, <clears throat> you have to try it, family. Um, as far as Comparing this food to Tanzania, it, it, it's totally different. The food here is totally different than Tanzania. Um, the food here is different than Kenya as well. We believe, or I believe, that the food here um, is the tastiest. And, and, and it could be from because of the, the fish that the other countries don't have. I don't know what it is, but definitely great food here. And it's definitely worth a visit to come out here. And even if you just try the food, family. I say, even if you just try the food, shout out for the super chat from Kate and Pat. When was the last time you were in the U.S.? Any plans to visit? All right. So the last time that we visited the United States of America was in 2018. We visited for a couple weeks. I had a family reunion in Georgia which, where uh, our ancestral land is. Um, let me see. We're, we're, we're part of Georgia. Americus, Americus, Georgia. Um, then we went from there to South Carolina, where my um, wife's ancestral family uh, is from. And um, South Carolina, from there we went to, uh, we went to Philly from there? Or Delaware? From South Carolina, I think we went to Delaware, because we did a lot of driving, family. We, we hit like a lot of states. We went to um, Delaware, then we went to Philly, and we stayed around that area for a while. Philly, Delaware, Jersey. Yeah, we went to New York from Philly. And then we went to New York. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, so we was we 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 was there for about two weeks. Hey. We had a good time. Yeah. Hold on. My sister is on this live. What's up, Dap? Oh man, we got that. Dap, what's up? That's my blood sister. Yeah. One of my blood sisters. That's right. What's up, boo? Yeah. Love you. Hey. <laughs> Peace of love to Daphne or Dap yes. Singleton who took my uh, <clears throat> cryptocurrency game from here all the way up to here. Oh man. I'm telling you, this queen. sister <laughs> is the cryptocurrency queen. Mm. She definitely, definitely can help anybody maximize their profits with cryptocurrency and we definitely appreciate you that yeah and holla at your uh your niece hold on let me uh oh hi auntie how are you <laughs> this is good these fries buttery too yeah but yeah yeah uh kate and pat asked does she teach courses on crypto um, she's always teaching us, so I don't know. You're going to have to holler at her. Talk to her. Um, I don't, hey, Dad, let us know if you want people to holler at you. Yeah, because, uh. We have to put something together, but, um, she's an amazing graphic design artist. She's whoo, off the chain. So I know she's super, super busy with that business, but maybe she's willing to do that. We'll talk to her. You can chat, chat with her right now. She's online. Yeah. Yeah. Amazing. Yeah. Definitely. And it's very important for everybody that's on this live to definitely learn about the cryptocurrencies if you haven't already. Because people was making all kinds of bags with the cryptocurrency family. I'm trying to um, put this down. So hold on for a second, family. Yeah. All right, family. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Okay, yeah. So, um... What was I saying? I forgot what I was saying. But yeah, yeah, it's important to learn about the cryptocurrencies. Um, I believe that that's the way to the future, or that's going to be the currency. It's already like currency. Um, 
learning about NFTs. You got the metaverse coming out. So it's a lot, a lot of ways you can make money. So I definitely would say, please learn, study up on these things so that you can get involved. Cause you're going to miss, you're going to miss the wave family if you don't get involved. Yeah. yeah. Mm. Absolutely. And we don't like to give financial advice ourselves because you know, you know, you make a bad decision that's on you, you know, but there are people who can give you some advice on or, or tips on how to start, get yourself started. Um, I think a lot of people go with the um, platform Coinbase. <clears throat> so starting there, that'll be a good start. Uh, Coinbase is really trusted around the world and it's probably the one, the top, what is it? It's in the top five, I think, platforms or top four. So, yeah. <clears throat> Somebody said, PT said, uh, crypto is a must. Uh, Aaron and family, you can start receiving Bitcoin donations right through your, wow, Twitter account and strike. It's super simple to see and receive. Oh, what is that? Oh, thank you. Oh, wow. Thank you. Oh. If you don't know what these are, these are called macrons. Macrons. It's a pretty delicate and elegant cookie. It's, um, I think the origin is French. And um, first time I saw these was on uh, MasterChef when they were preparing these. Yeah, these are macarons. Yeah. yeah. And uh, wow, they just blessed us with some free ones. These can be quite expensive too in bakeries. So that was nice. Wow. Woo. And they come in different flavors. So this one looks like maybe vanilla or something, but they come in different um, flavors. Like I had the, I remember the chocolate ones I had with the chocolate, they come in strawberry, chocolate, or so many different flavors. Mango, like those are amazing. And they're hard to make. So if you can make them, you're, you're the bomb. They're not easy to make. Yeah. Mm hmm. Yeah, that's good to know, PT, so you can receive um, donations. <clears throat> and I'm sorry, my allergies are, are really acting up. That's why I sound a little nasal. Um, and with the changing of seasons, that happens to me all the time. Um, so donations right through your Twitter account, your strike, it's super simple and send and receive. That's good to know. Mm-hmm. My sister said the key to, to any investing is don't risk what you can't afford to lose. Mm. That's heavy. That's smart too. So that's from my sister. She said, um, don't risk what you can't afford to lose. So it's like, it's easy and it's good to start small. You know, there are people who start their accounts with $20 here. $10 here, you know, people start small and um, you forget about it because it's like, okay, what's that? That's like something you probably spend on snacks, <laughs> you know, so that's a smart piece of advice right there. A little gem she just dropped. Um, Stephanie, uh, MA, those are so good. Yes, they are amazing. Macarons are amazing. They're very good. And um, <laughs> gained weight eating those in South Korea. Yeah, you can. You have to kind of, yeah, you have to limit yourself on how many of those you eat. Um, you must eat uro, uroe and singa. What's that? Sumi, sumi, what is that? Are the mosquitoes better in Burundi? Oh, my goodness. No. <laughs> Very quick. No. <laughs> mosquitoes. Are the mosquitoes. Switch it. Um... Are you saying compared to where, Stephanie? <laughs> She's laughing. Uh, yeah, mosquitoes, no. I, mm -mm. Nah, they're in my top five list. You mean who, Ayla? Yeah, you can switch them. Switch it on you. You had to say something? Nah, the mosquitoes for me, mm -mm. they're in my top five list worldwide. Like, mm -mm. mosquitoes, yeah. Yeah, they do have them. But it's like, um, like I tell many people, when you think about gnats, mosquitoes, all those kind of bugs and things, you have to remember life is happening. That's the best way I can say it. Um, I don't like to be somewhere where bugs don't exist. No, I would. Because no, that means, because I'm thinking, that hey, what's going on with the environment? You know, no. Remember when the bees disappeared in the states? No. Nah. Worry about no bees, no. <laughs> no, no. Hey, good. You ain't Life bothering me. Why? Good to know. Does it have to Boy. be uh, <laughs> flies? I don't understand flies. Mm -mm. 
Why does it have to be mosquitoes? Those are the only two essays that just get to me. Because during the day, you can't chill because there's always a fly flying they, around. That's what they're doing now. They At nighttime, you can't chill because you always got to scratch because of the mosquitoes, family. Yeah, so I, I, I don't mean... I don't get no. Good, it ain't got to bother me. Ah, ah, ah. Because I can't stand flies. They flying around now. They on the back room. Like, can y'all go? Can y'all go? Like, you're doing a lot. No. Uh, yay, natural. Yay. But yeah. y'all got to stop. Yeah. Look at the one, two, Ooh, three mm-hmm. flies right saying. there. Yeah. Uh, family travel history said I saw a total of three to four bees in a whole year. Yeah. Oh man, yeah, that's bad. Now we need bees. We need bees. Oh, wait, I'm gonna put it on you, but I, I must say this. No, no, bees. Before I put it on you, uh-huh. someone said, asked us uh, the flies and Barunia. Bat. Shout out to all the super chats. Yeah, Let me say y'all. that for a second. Shout out to all things mm-hmm. re. Right. All things right. All right. Hold on. I pressed the wrong button. Shout out to you. Shout out One Nation Under Black Family. Um, I visited the motherland Ghana in July 2021. Moving to Africa in January 2022. Getting out of Babylon. Thank you so much for an awakening on Africa. Thank you. Thank you, family. We appreciate you. And we just vessels. That's all we are. We just vessels that, that the creator just uses. You know what I mean? But we're going to get back to the mosquitoes. So in Burundi... The mosquitoes are bad. You know, they're a little bit bad. But Air Heart, South Carolina? <laughs> I knew he was going to do it. I knew he was going to do it. No. Uh-uh, family. Ain't nobody with you on that one. That, if that's still yeah. on here, mm-hmm. that. <laughs> hey, that. <laughs> you tell them that. <laughs> it's silence on here. It is silence right now. It is silence. It is crickets. <laughs> Nobody's with you on that. <laughs> That's because a lot of people ain't been to the Air Heart, South yeah, Carolina to experience <laughs> those <laughs> mosquitoes that come from she the pits agrees. of hell. How you going to agree, Dap? Come on, for real. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Dap. Thank you. Thank you, Dap. That's, that's why I love Dap. <laughs> I love and appreciate Dap. I'm going to be honest. Yeah. <laughs> They don't hunt me down like that when I go. Man. They love me. The so most, anyway. I get like three or four bites. It ain't too horrible. What I was getting at well. is like somebody was saying they only saw three to four bees in a whole year. Now, That's I not like cool. Honey, uh-uh. Because when you see stuff like that disappearing in the environment, there's something definitely wrong. And so when you see life, when you see life happening like it does on the continent, it's a beautiful thing. So, I mean, yeah, we can we can go without a lot of the mosquitoes and stuff, but you know that there's a lot of things happening in nature and it's continuing, it's doing what it's, nature is doing what it's intended to do. And you also have a lot of natural things. The food is, is natural, the food is organic, you know, so I can appreciate that. <clears throat> That's what I was trying to say, so. Because I didn't like that. You know, we growing up, we used to see the... Um, I don't know if you guys remember the caterpillars crawling up the tree. That was it makes my skin crawl. But I remember that, and then I, I see there's an absence of it in in recent years. And then all of the bees and the wasps and hornets and all that stuff flying around, and it's a lack thereof. And there's something wrong with that. Mm-hmm. Uh huh. Yeah. Yeah. Somebody said losing bees and butterflies is not a good thing. Nah. It's for vegetation, oh, yeah, for the no, plants. No, no, no. It ain't. I wish it would transfer that to energy flies and mosquitoes. to flies and mosquitoes. <laughs> I wish that energy would transfer. Yeah. yeah. But um peace and love to the family. I'ma uh, just say that. Shout out to Kaiser Mia restaurant for this good food. Yeah. If you come to Burundi, Bujumbura, definitely this is a spot you want to check out. Yes. It's got a nice outside ambience. Mm-hmm. The uh you got Bambi, you got a um deer, an actual live friendly deer. You know what? I think it might be friendly hippos here. I'm not going to test that out, but <laughs> we've seen a friendly deer. I actually right. almost petted it. Yeah. And, um, yeah. She got, it's a cool. Shakur Pico. Pico, I hope I said your name right. It says swatting them is good exercise. Yeah. <laughs> that's that's funny. I like that. Mm-hmm. It's irking when um, you try to eat, though. Yeah. Yeah, we know Where malaria is real. You're right, Claudine. You're right. Malaria is real. Be, be careful. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You're right. 
Do deer eat fish? Um, they eat vegetation. They eat like leaves and carrots. Oh, never mind. Yeah. I was about to get a fish. Now, Ayla, why'd you say the bees are important? Yeah, they got honey and stuff. And like the beeswax. <laughs> oh, wait, what? I said, hey. You said they got. <laughs> we got the English teacher in the building, family. <laughs> yeah, they have. They happen to have honey. Right. Mm. And they happen to produce. <laughs> hmm. oh, do they, they produce beeswax? Yeah. Yeah, but you know what? Bees are also important because they pollinate That's different right. plants. That too, they pollinate. You know, so they're important to the oxygen. circle of life and, and exactly. the way that uh, yeah, a, a lot of plants and vegetables and fruits yeah. and stuff get grown. I don't have yeah. beef with bees. It's the mosquitoes and flies. Like bees, yeah, y'all do y'all thing. Mm -hmm. Mosquito. My <laughs> last scoop of mashed potatoes. Potato. What happened? I'm upset. This is my last little scoop of mashed potatoes. Man. I might need some of these to go. <laughs> Are you tearing up? Oh, I was about to... I thought you was tearing up. <laughs> mm. The meal was very good. Yeah. Oh, good. Yeah. Okay, so my wife is going to try the macaroon. Yeah. Not the president. What? In uh, France, I, I guess. That's his name. I guess, huh? <laughs> yep, it's great for... <laughs> Allergies too, yeah, honey. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna take one. I'm only allowed to have one. All right, so this is what a macaron looks like. Mmm. When your teeth go in there, it just sinks. It's like a um. You see it? Oh my god. That's retarded. Not like the Titanic. Mmm. That's amazing. That's amazing right there. That is. Mmm. I like the depth of feel. Keep it up there for you. It just sunk like. Oh, okay. It's like a layer of like oh, crunchiness. Say, yeah, that's it's a layer of crunchiness, yeah. then it gets like real <laughs> mm, soft on the interior there. Yeah. You know what? Your nails look real nice too, babe. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. I got to get them done again though. Yeah, I know. These are, this is good, y'all. I want another one, but I can't have another one. Mm. No, I don't eat mine now. Mm. Yeah. That's good. I'm trying to take half. Mm. <laughs> Okay, I feel you, sis. Um, you can mess around getting weight eating these. Mm, you can, yeah. We had some in uh, Egypt. Ooh. Let me tell you. Mm. Oh, that's good. It's like we gain weight. Matter of fact, look at the yeah. video when I was in Egypt. Look how burly I was. That we were sort of that down. a couple like maybe like twenty pounds was probably from like, eating the macarons. It tastes like a, a cookie mixed with a caramel. Mm. A moist one. Okay, Ayla, okay. We see it. All right. Nice. Hire me. Yeah. Yeah. Right. <laughs> if you need a clown for a birthday party, hi Ayla. I perform at funerals, yeah. birthday parties, yeah. um, bar mitzvahs, bar mitzvahs, yeah. um, quinceañeras, all of it. Yeah. Thank you. Um, um, gender reveals. <laughs> all right. <laughs> yeah, gender reveals. Yeah. All of that. All right. <laughs> mm. Mm. What's the flavor like? Yeah. What's the flavor? Mm. I don't. It's like a vanilla butter. Mm. Vanilla pound cake. It's some pound cake. Vanilla pound cake. This is good. We might gotta get some more of them. Who did that? It's about to be burly season, family. Moist. Let me tell you. You said it's moist. Yeah, it's like you ever had a really good. I'm not talking about no dry pound cake. I'm talking pound cake like my grandma used to make, where you can see the butter in it. It's like mm. real moist. Mixed with maybe a like a, a, a vanilla cookie or something, it's that's good. Yeah. Mm. Okay. That's it's good. Like a, so, yeah. is it worth? Uh, go ahead. Mm. Mm, all right. Hey. Hey. You didn't try yours. I ain't oh. trying mine. Don't eat mine either. Ooh. This might be like up in my favorite dessert now. Yeah. For real? Yeah. yeah. First is ice cream, then cookies. Might gotta be these mm. and cheesecake. Hold on, how about lava cakes from Pizza Hut, or was that Domino's? Yeah, it had butter. I'm like, what? <laughs> that was good. It got like a salty sweet thing, and I love that balance. That balance. Mm -hmm. You got. I love that balance. Balance. Yeah, I remember mm. Grandma's yeah, 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 You can right. see the butter in it. I looked at it. I'm like, yeah. Mm. I say to the ancestors. Yes. I miss her. Ooh, I miss her. I miss her cooking. Okay. Yeah. Mm. Stories. Mm. Mm -hmm. I miss her. 
Shout out to you, Grandma. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Shout mm. out to Grandma. Yeah, shout out to Grandma. Mm. That lady could cook and bake. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Macarons are so good at room temperature. Yeah. yeah. Room temperature. I think they're like room temperature warmish. Oh, let me That's wash this right down here. real quick. Let me wash it down. Yeah, because I got like fish kind of taste. The oh, fish was good though. Yeah, it was. Man. Room so you think we need some more macarons? You know what else is Are good they macarons or macaroon? Macaroon. Uh. Macaroon. All right, so. Sorry about that, family. All right, so, as you can see. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It looks like a miniature, um, I wasn't going to say burger, but no. <laughs> but no. Do you guys go to the barber or beauty shop? I need to go to a barber real soon. Because look look at my my my, joy, my um Uncle Phil is like. It's coming in. It's completely in right now. Which I don't have a problem with, but, you know, my wife loves it. Let me see. <laughs> you know. Yeah, it just melts. Are you know what I'm Your teeth just like. It just melts. It's like, mm, that's good. That's good. You're all right. It's like pound cake or vanilla pound cake. Yeah. Something mixed yeah. I like how it's not completely like all just sugar. Like it's balanced. It's that's it is. And salty. And it's hard to make those. You can yeah. Do it is. Time you can make those. With the, the textures all, mm. like the textures there, when the flavors the there. Part, the exterior has to be a certain way. It can't be thick. It's yeah, like it needs to air. I wonder how it melt like that. It has to be airy. Whoever made that. Yeah, the made Uncle Phil definitely kicking in candy, man. That's a chef chef. <clears throat> mm. That's a chef chef. That's good. They look nice and everything. We might have to get us a box of these to go. You know what else is addictive? I found out recently. Them animal crackers. Why are you even eating those? <laughs> That's what kids eat in kindergarten. Now look, okay. Them handle animal crackers. Okay. Them animal crackers are addictive. Mmm. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. One day I'm gonna just go out without the hat and just have my uncle feel this rock. You know what I mean? See the thing. People I think I want to get it shaped up though, like real sharp. Get this sharp. I'll probably have my beard sharp and just let this go. Probably get like some corn rolls or something on the oh, side. Oh yeah, mom used like to I, do that. Yeah. Mom used to corn roll. Yeah. I was trying to grow the front end. I, I use um, what's it? Castor oil? Not castor oil. Mm -hmm. That Jamaican oil. Okay. I was trying hard, family, but I. It was a struggle, family. It wasn't almost there. It was a struggle. <laughs> it was almost there. My yeah. head was struggling at the top. <laughs> you know, for our baby, I love you how you are. It don't matter. You cut it off. Let it grow. Uh, Candyman said, I cut my Uncle Phil off and went with the bald head and beard. I feel you, that's a good look. But sometimes, man, I be trying to switch the whole game up. <laughs> Got the reverse mohawk. Yeah. <laughs> reverse, reverse mohawk. mohawk. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Back in the day, that was that was hey. like the style a little bit. You know what I mean? Like ain't nobody say nothing. You got uh, was Benjamin Franklin on a hundred dollar bill. He said, "Look, man, I'm gonna take this picture. This is how I'm gonna be on there." Yeah. And look at that. When you see hundred dollar bills now, what, what, what people gonna do? If I whip some out now, what people gonna do? If I take them to the club somewhere, or matter of fact. Not that kind of club. I'm talking about regular club. And go to the bar. <laughs> <laughs> we don't waste family funds like that. <laughs> we don't waste family funds like that. Yeah, yeah if I take it to the bar, <coughs> the bar, the bartender's going to be very delighted. Yeah. Anyway, we're going to change that. Uh, how you doing today, Ayla? <laughs> I cannot. I cannot. <laughs> God. Uh, yeah. So, uh, yeah. What they said? Yeah. <laughs> now, this is good. This is interesting. So, we're sitting outside. It is raining right now. And we are fully covered and still able to enjoy the outdoors. And um, it's pretty chill. It's a nice, serene. You hear the birds tweeting. So, we're enjoying this nice, serene space. It's a really nice restaurant. I like this. Yeah. And I think this is rainy season now, so it's been raining every day for the past, what, three, three, four days? It's been raining like this? It's been raining every day. Yeah, every day now. So it must be rainy season, but like 
I like this idea so you can still enjoy being outside and dining, listening to the birds and whatnot, yeah. and um, you know, enjoying yourself. Nice. Yeah. So now that we finished the meal, my wife is gonna go over the prices of the meal that we just ate. What you guys have? So, I think I had we the fish brochette. Fishes. Oh, yeah. We, what we had, the, the three fish brochette with curry. Yes. And chips. Yes. And I had one of these. Yes. And I happened to have had this one. I thought you stopped drinking Sprite. I wanted one today. But on a regular, I don't drink Sprite. Uh-huh. I drink, like, the maracuja okay. or the water. This is, you know, just a little special annual Sprite drinkage. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. All yeah. right. So, the beautiful wife is going is about to go over the prices <laughs> of the meal. The okay. Same. You had the, the brochettes, the curry. You had the fish curry brochettes, right? Yeah. yeah. All right. So, we all had the um, fish curry brochettes with the curry sauce. That's 12,000 um, Burundian francs. So 12,000 Burundian francs is around what, like $5, I believe? Yeah. $5 to $6-ish. So that's $5 each right now. So that's 15 so far. Yes. The chips were separate. Were, mm-hmm, I think, separate. So the chips were three, 3,000. 3,000. Okay, so that's three thousand each. So that's nine twenty six dollars so far. No, twenty four dollars. I'm tolling it. Why you ain't want to total it? I had mine was two. I had the puree, which was the mashed potatoes. That's two thousand. It's less than y'all's. Oh, okay. All right. So total that's it was like twenty six plus thirty eight, thirty six thousand. Uh huh. Eight. Thirty six thousand plus eight thousand, and it was. Forty-four. Thirty-six thousand. Where did you get that from? That's the twelve. That's forty-four total. Okay. The fish, twelve, 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 thirty-six, and okay, you have another eight. Forty-four thousand. And eight. Forty-four. Forty-four. Now your juices. What'd you have? So that's like twenty dollars, family. So far, I had. So far. Juice, which was where are we with the juices? Mine's three. Juices. I think mine's two. Juice, yeah. juice, 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 juice. The fruit. I think they're all two fifty. The juices. Okay. Just the fruit, yeah. <clears throat> so 250, 255, 750 total for juice. Okay. This is two. Oh, that's only two. Oh. You had something different. Three. Mine's three I had fresh three. juice, so mine was 250. Mine's 3,000, two, five, eight. Eight total? Yeah. So that's around like 20. No, that's 750. It's almost like 22, 23 dollars. Yeah. yeah. Now, this is not a lower kind of scale restaurant at all. It's more of a, like, medium-ish, yeah. if you will, family. More of a medium-ish kind of, like, mid-scale. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and it could be lower than that, you know, but that's the price right now. Yeah. Um, oh, the macarons. Yeah, the macarons. Thank you to the owner. Dessert. That was nice. Very nice. Um, thank you to the family that owns this uh, beautiful space. They're a lovely family. We met them. And um, had a great time. I think we'll be back, definitely. Definitely. Yeah. Especially the mashed potatoes, man. Mm -hmm. And the um, the fish. I like that. That curry was really good. Mm -hmm. It was really good. And everything was fresh. You could taste everything. It was very fresh. Yeah. yeah. And as I look at the total of our Super Chats, it comes up to about the same as the meal. <laughs> so thank you all so much yeah, for that, family. We appreciate that. Yeah, we love y'all, yeah. and uh, my wife has something that she has to say for the sponsors. Right. And today, our sponsors are, I want you guys to check out Amoretic.com. Amoretic, A-M-O-R-E-D-I-C, -E is an urban brand name uh, clothing store created by the recording, recording artist and producer Melody Weaver. Uh, the word Amoretic means to be a successful, loving person of African descent and one who exudes good character. 
So you want to check out Amoretic.com online. All you kings and queens who need some new drip, some new gear. And they have all kinds of items like backpacks and shirts and shorts and sneakers, hoodies, much, much more. Things for the home. Wait a minute. Things for the home. We're going to put that in the, um, the chat and the description for you. That's A-M-O-R-E, like Amor, <clears throat> D-I-C dot com, Amoretic dot com. Also, check out LegacyProductionsLLC.com for a wealth of literature on recreating family history and planning for future generations. Legacy Productions LLC was founded to educate, advance, and publish knowledge of family preservation. Emphasis is on documenting one's life's experiences, social history, and lessons learned to pass down to future generations. So be proactive now and check out LegacyProductionsLLC.com. Thank you. Thank you to our sponsors. Yeah, thank you to all the sponsors, and please make sure you go to the unapologeticnomads.com. Hit on the button that says um, eh, 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 products, yes. featured products. Go there and check those products out on Instagram, family. You got Lance Plus, and you also got... G and J Mac. shout out to them. So we're working also on, if, if anybody out there who has... Uh, uh, mm, a solution for shipping. Um, it seems like it's a problem worldwide right now. So a lot of the vendors are having problems on the continent with trying to ship things in bulk because the shipping cost is becoming like astronomical. Um, a lot of times customers are having to pay more for shipping than they are for the actual items they're buying or purchasing. So we're working on that and doing some research right now and trying to find a way for vendors and companies to be able to ship a lot easier um, and quicker if possible <clears throat> so only reach out to us if you have a solution we don't want somebody reaching out and it's like I think um, no if you have a solution for that and mainly in for right now East Africa so <clears throat> and also shout out to Wow Mira Tyson yes. for the super chat thank you sis yes. hey there uh, my beautiful unapologetic nomad family many blessings to you thank you so much and much love to you as well. Also, those of you who would like to advertise on our channel, you can do that as well by going to unapologeticnomads.com and clicking on the tab that says advertise on or advertise with us. So advertise on our YouTube channel. Um, all the lives, like what we do now, we will promote your business or product or event, um, or whatever you have on our lives. Check yeah. us out. <clears throat> and thank you again, Mira. Thank you so much. We really appreciate you. We appreciate everybody who sent super chats. We appreciate all the members, everybody who subscribes, everybody who just takes their time out of their day to watch the unapologetic no mass family. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, gosh. Is that a beat? Oh. <laughs> Dang. I almost started running. It was a fly. But yeah. Uh, everyone. Um, like, thank you for, like, <laughs> watching, I think. <laughs> <laughs> and, like, thank you for, like, the love and support and whatnot that you, like, give <clears throat> to us. And, no, I'm just playing. But, yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, wouldn't it? <laughs> oh, we had a... Africa is a feature. Oh, thank you for the super chat. What is it? What is it? Euro? Thank you. Yeah. What does it say? Africa Thanks for sharing future. beautiful background. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is a real beautiful place. If you come to Bujumbura, um, oh, yeah, let me show the, uh, the menu. Yeah, you might have to lift it up a tad bit. There you go. It's not in the center, but it's, it's like on the side, kind of. There you go. So a little bit more. Yeah, that's it. Hold on, let me change this. All right, there we go. There we go. You, that's, that's not it. <laughs> that's not it. You got to move it over to the, some. To the, the right. other way. Right. Yes. <laughs> there you go. Yes. And that's how you spell Kizamiya. Yeah. And we met the, uh, the I, I think it's named after the their daughters, oh, and it's such yeah. pretty, yeah. pretty little uh, girls. Yeah. yeah. That's beautiful. That's yeah. a beautiful name, Kizamiya. Yay. Nice. 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 Yes. Beautiful yeah. girls and uh, beautiful family, and um, I love the name of the restaurant. Nice, nice. And uh, again, thank you guys for tuning in, all of the members and subscribers and the viewers, everybody. Um, 
Oh, okay. <laughs> I said I was tapping the table. But anyway, thank all of you for tuning in. As always, uh, much love to you. Stay at a high vibration and do something that you enjoy that makes you feel great. And um, yeah, hope you have a great day. Yeah. yeah. Thank you for tuning in today, um, for watching, giving us constant love and support on a daily basis. <laughs> Thank you to our members. Shout out to y'all. Shout out to our mods. Shout Mr. out to Hillary, Noella Dixon. Noella Dixon. Um, all of y'all. The names aren't coming right now, but yeah. yeah. Shout out to all of you. Yeah. All right, yeah. somebody said, this is, and this is an interesting idea. It's just, you got to be able to trust people. That's the thing. Yeah. No scammers, nobody doing nothing shaky or shifty or like uh, slithery family. Yeah. But somebody said, if you could find enough people to fill a ship container, splitting the cost may be more bearable. That's true. That's true. Yeah, we got to figure something out because there's a lot of people out here with like, they have some just amazing crafts and things. Yeah. But the shipping is the issue. But I'm speaking more of I'm speaking more of shipping to customers, shipping to individuals, not shipping to a warehouse to sit, you know, because there's no I don't know anybody with a warehouse yeah. that's already set up like that. But I'm talking about people, individuals who are trying to buy from vendors, and then their shipping costs is coming out to be more than what they're ordering, um, than the the item they're ordering. So that's what I'm referring to. So, yeah. So, but um, I know the answer will come one day. Yeah. <clears throat> Anybody has any good uh, solutions for this issue, please let us know. You could DM us on unapologetic underscore nomads or hit us up on um, YouTube in the comment section. But it's going to go back just unapologetic underscore nomads on Instagram, family. That's yeah. right. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. We love y'all. We appreciate y'all, family. And we the unapologetic nomads. And we unapologetically. Nomadic. Nomadic. Peace. Thank you for the super chat, Noella. <laughs> Thank you, uh, Noella. Yeah.